now we just take a look a back and how we can just look about how the Newton's third law will work and we all know that Newton's third law will use for every action there is an equal and opposite reaction so here we have two bottles one and two and we just connect the two bottles by using the two pencils by making holes at the center of the two bottles and then we made one basement for fixing the motor and there we can fix the motor with the fan and then this is the plug which is used to connect the battery and we are going to connect the battery we can use the battery that is 2.9 volts battery that is and here we can work how the Newton start law will works and Newton start law for every action there is an equal and opposite reaction in this case the bottle moves in this direction so the force exerted by the fan and this motor will be in this direction therefore the movement the movement of this board a small board will be in this direction now we will take a look how it's going to be work by putting it in the water now we are in a small pool now I am gonna connecting this thing with the battery and we will just take a look at how it's going to be works and I am gonna connecting this right now by putting these things now I just connected these things just look at this now how it's going to be work so the force exerted by the motor is in this direction and the board will be moving in this direction so just take a look and it should be the Newton start law so it is moving in this direction now I am just placing the board here and then it will move from this place to this place we will just take a look how it's going to be moved just see that so it works completely on the Newton's third law so it is a small project for my brother to produce in a scientific competition to participate in scientific competition thanks for watching this video